Uh, more fall-like weather this week, unfortunately, just not fall-like leaves, all right? We're tracking temperatures well into the 60s here over the next couple of days. Uh, however, those winds are going to kick up a little bit as we fast forward precipitation possible here this weekend. Overall, we're waking up to 32 in Great Falls, 30 degrees in the capital right now. 20s just west of the divide, a few high 30s in northeastern Montana. We'll start the day out with a couple of clouds. However, it will clear up a little bit down, uh, during the noon hour. Don't let those clouds uh, worry you too much. We're not really tracking anything in the way of rain today, and it's not really going to affect temperatures. Kind of another wave of clouds is going to move in then late this evening into the overnight hours. Wednesday, today's high temperatures well into the 50s, 56 in Great Falls, a few 60s even west of the divide, and high 40s in northeastern Montana. Then tonight, much more mild than what we were last night. Going to see 43 in Great Falls, 37 in the capital. Still chilly, though, near Kalispell and northeastern Montana in the mid to low 30s there. Tomorrow, pushing the 70s in central Montana. A couple forecast models were anticipating 70. I'm not quite there yet, but we'll still be well into the 60s for most of central Montana, likely hitting a few 70s though in eastern Montana. Now, one of the trade offs though, as we look into Thursday is as those temperatures start to warm up on Wednesday, part of the reason for that is going to be increased winds. So we'll start to see the winds ramp up on Thursday, likely 30 to 40 miles per hour, primarily from Cutbank to Great Falls, kind of in the common areas there. And and to show you how those weather systems are playing out, we'll backtrack a little bit now. Wednesday up to uh, Wednesday right now, 6 a.m. We're looking at high 60s for most of the state on Wednesday, all thanks to a nice high pressure ridge. We are tracking a little bit of a cold front as that high pressure system moves out, low pressure moves in, little white lines. You notice how tight those get together. Those are isobars, areas of consistent pressure. That is telling us we're going to get pretty darn windy there on Thursday, likely still a little bit windy into Friday. As that system pushes through, some mountain snow can't be ruled out. A couple of showers throughout the plains as well on Friday, but not a real heavy hitter out of this system. That system will continue to move out, keeping us a little bit cooler, though, into the weekend. Over the next seven days, here's how things play out for us. We're looking at 56, mostly sunny skies today in Gray Falls. And, uh, yeah, looking downright nice on Wednesday. Winds ramping up, though, late Wednesday into Thursday, lasting through Friday here in the capital. We're looking at a daytime high of uh, 57 today, well into the 60s tomorrow. But wind returning to the forecast Thursday and Friday, Keely.